Good morning guys. Happy Vlogmas Day 3. This morning I woke up and instead of going straight to my internship, I had a graduation photo session and it went so so well. I actually was going to do my friend Darby tonight, um, but then it said it had a 60% chance of raining. So I texted her, I was like, hey, can we do it in the morning because the weatherman says it's going to rain. And honestly, I can like kind of see it. It's, it's kind of nice outside right now, but I can see it like in the sky. It's like... It's definitely gonna get there so we decided to do it in the morning and I'm so happy that we did because the lighting looks amazing in the morning and I mean I think it looks really good at sunset too but I just kind of forgot how good it looks in the morning and like I feel like it's more rewarding in the morning because you wake up so early and like you kind of like are doing it with the sunrise so I'm really excited to edit those pictures but right now I'm going to head to my internship I usually go in at 8 but I'm gonna be there at 10 today so I'm probably just gonna stay a little bit later um and then I have a final tonight and it's like my one and only final because like I said in my last vlog I'm only taking two classes and one class is the internship course itself so yeah I'm gonna head to my internship I honestly don't really know how much I'm gonna vlog today because I'm gonna be like go 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 like after my internship have to go to the bookstore get a scantron then I have to like study until my final and yeah so I'm probably gonna combine today and tomorrow but we will see how much content we get So I just got off internship and now I'm gonna go to the UCF bookstore to pick up a Scantron. You can get free Scantrons um, on campus at the student union or all night study, but I just really wanna just like get it and run out. So I'm just gonna pay because um, I don't really have that much time. Um, I'm being interviewed for a documentary on our sorority and that is at three and it's currently one and I have no makeup on so I need to go home and do my makeup but I also really really have to study for my final like ah, god bless <laughs> hello we're a little bit close up now but I put on makeup because I'm going to be in a documentary for my sorority I'm not really sure what they're gonna ask me I feel like I should have prepared the answers to the questions like previously because I don't do well on the spot but I guess we're just gonna wing it so Wish me good luck on that. But since I had to put makeup on, I thought this would be the perfect time to take a sponsored post. I'm so freaking excited because I'm getting sponsored by Sephora Collection. I literally just recently posted a Sephora Collection video about all my favorite lip story lipsticks, and that one wasn't sponsored, but they may have like found me through that, honestly. I'm not really sure, but I'm hyped about it. Like I appreciate that it's in Sephora, obviously, because Sephora's all bougie and stuff, but it's more affordable prices, and I feel like they have a lot of dupes for other makeup brands. I'm just really quickly going to read the brief that they sent me and make sure that I have everything covered in my picture. So now that I have the iPhone XS Max, all my pictures turn out way better on my phone than my actual camera, which makes me so mad, because like now I'm like gonna use my camera even less. I don't know, I feel like everything just like looks a little bit better in the selfie cam, so I think I'm gonna take my picture on my iPhone. See, I really wish I had my nails done for this because they look hideous, but whatever. My hair looks so flat and I even tried to use like some volumizing something or another and I don't know, it just looks disgustingly flat. Yesterday was like the first time I straightened my hair and didn't blow dry it, so maybe that was like the reason, I don't even know. done with the documentary and I struggled so hard. I have a really hard time putting my thoughts into words and it's especially hard when there's so many people around me. Like I'm better for my own videos because I know what I'm going to talk about beforehand and I literally like write down like not a script but like bullet points of like what I want to talk about um and maybe like how I'm gonna say it so yeah that was a little bit of a struggle for me but we got through it and they came to take like some b-roll of our room so I had to clean really fast which was kind of good for me because my room was like a freaking mess um before that <laughs> so it like forced me to clean my room but now I'm looking at all the pictures that I took for um the Sephora collection Instagram post. I have the product on my lips right now. This is on my lips and you would think it's like a crazy color, but it's like a sheer like lip color and it feels like a chapstick. It's so moisturizing. Like, I don't know. I don't know if I should take more. I should probably just take more just for a safety net. But like, 
Do I want to take more? No. Also, before the documentary, I was freaking out because I felt like I didn't have enough time in the day. Um, but I also just found out that my final is only at 7. So that gives me like an extra 30 minutes to like just chill and like study and go over my notes. Because um, usually class starts at 6.30. So that's nice. And I feel very productive today. Like I said, I did a graduation photo shoot. I kind of want to like edit a picture. I don't know. I just think they turn out so, so good. And let me know if you guys want me to like do a vlog on graduation pictures or like editing or something like that. Like mostly I use like already made presets, not the ones that I sell on my site, but just like m more natural ones for like graduation photos. I usually use those and like tweak it to how I want the actual photo to be. Maybe I can give you guys a little sneak peek of the pictures we took today. Good morning. They said that they'll send us like a rough cut by Friday. Wow. And they'll send us kind of like a, the film won't be done until the end of the month. So oh. They said that they're submitting this to like film festivals. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Like Whoa. the type, he is like trying to explain, he's like, so you send it to this, this film festival and if it like keeps on like moving up, it can like go to like uh, us on the Oscars. <laughs> But he was explaining to me that, like, these types of film festivals that they're submitting you to, that's, like, how things get on, like, get an Oscar. You know what I mean? What the hell? I know. Um, that's crazy, So First exciting all, about KD, though. Second of all, I plugged my YouTube channel, so if that makes Bro, the cut, and that goes to, to film festivals. But it's still, but the thing is, it's gonna go to a film festival regardless, so, like, you already have that plug. Damn. I really mm -hmm. hope they put it in, because that'd be nice. Yeah. <laughs> no, they are, though. Like, it's not just, like, a school project for them. Right. That's crazy. Wow. Yeah. That's awesome. So I'm excited like, to okay. see that. So, I'm heading into my final. Wish me luck. I kind of feel good about it. Like, last time I didn't study, I thought I did really good. I ended up doing really bad, you know. But I studied this time, so, like, hopefully it turns out well. It's probably sad that all I can think about is treating myself to a nice manicure, pedicure after this final. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm taking grad pics with Hi. Sydney. <laughs> She's literally the most beautiful girl ever. But I have back-to-back -back grad shoots today. So I got my handy dandy camera. So I haven't vlogged much today, but I did go to my internship this morning, then came straight home and did a grad photo shoot, and then I have another one in 30 minutes. So I'm just chilling on the PBR couch because I need a break. I walked a lot just now, got my exercise in for the day, so I'm very excited to take a shower after this shoot. and I am finally about to get my nails done if you guys watch my previous vlogs you would know that I've been waiting for forever I think the last time I got my nails done was like November 10th and it's currently December 3rd which is that's crazy I feel like I've never gone that long with my gel nails but they need to be done and I kind of want to ask for like rounded nails because whenever I get square ones they chip and snag and do all sorts of bad things even though I love the look of square nails but I think I'm gonna try something different and see if it works out for me so I'm gonna go to Avenue Nails it's in like the Publix complex if you guys go to UCF then you would know um, usually I go to FX but I don't know this is just so much closer like FX is just it's not too far but it's just you know this is a lot closer so whatever both of my grad shoots went really well even though it was like overcast it's actually better to shoot in overcast because you don't get like too much harsh light on the portraits so that's exciting i'm excited to edit everyone's pictures get round nails and they look so good like i actually might start getting round nails but i'm kind of really picky when it comes to it because i want it to be symmetrical like as you can see it's not really that rounded i don't know does that make sense like this one still i would consider square it needs to be like rounded more on the edge right there but I'm just like really picky with my nails. Like if I'm paying for it, then I want them to look really good since it's gonna be on my nails for like two weeks. So as you guys saw, I got my nails done. I asked for the same color on my toes and my nails, um, but this one was gel and that one was normal nail polish and they were not the same color and I was just like,
that was my reward. I'm done with finals, done with my second to last semester here at UCF, which is insane, but I just wrapped a present for my best friend, Laura. As you guys know, she has been like in so many of my vlogs. She's like my first best friend here at UCF. Um, I met her in Summer B and she's moving to new york and it's so sad and like literally so crazy and like it's honestly not even hitting me that she's moving to new york i got her a little going away present and you'll just have to see what i got her in the next vlog because i think i'm gonna end this vlog here i promise i'll try to get back on my grind with like daily vlogs it's just that these days were like so freaking boring so i couldn't really do anything about it but tomorrow is my last day of internship um for the semester. I'm continuing with UCF social media for the spring semester so that's some really exciting news and also if you guys watched my birthday vlog you know that Ryan got me a UCF sweatshirt for my birthday and he bought it off Amazon and I liked it. I really liked it but then I was at tailgate this past Saturday and I literally saw a girl like wearing this sweatshirt and I was like oh my god where'd you get it like when did you get it and she was like the UCF bookstore and it was still there so I ended up buying this one and I think I'm just gonna return the other one just because like I don't know I just need like one sweatshirt um so this is what it looks like it's like kind of like a more vintage feel as you can see it's like a heathered gray so I'm kind of afraid about that because I stained my sweatshirt so bad I got it 25% off so that meant it was like $48 or something like that so that was definitely a plus but I will see you guys in my next Vlogmas vlog. Bye!